I think that's something he's had trouble with, something we got to fix, something we got to address. I think he's throughout the years, like year and change now, he's been really good at missing barrels. This is one of those days he didn't miss a lot of barrels. Uh, happens sometimes. Uh, they fought back. You give him credit. Uh, we walk out of here with two out of three. I'm uh, going to find the positives in it, and it's definitely a tough game to lose, but it happens throughout the course of the season. What can you tell us about Fernando Tatis at this point? Nothing right now. I think everybody saw what happened on the field, so we're hoping he's okay. Uh, we'll find out in time here. Uh, he seems in pretty good spirits right now. Uh, we'll find out how severe, how mild it is here pretty shortly. The decision to keep Whistler in, can you just walk us through that? Yeah, I mean, that's uh, when you're in extra innings, you got to extend guys. Uh, at some point in time, you got one pitcher left available outside of Kirby. And so, like, you're trying to get as far as you can. Craig wasn't available today. No, Craig was. Kirby and uh, you would have seen, yeah, you would have seen Craig prior to that moment if he was available today. Decision to run Ian there. Obviously, the, the speed, but then you potentially run the situation you ran into. You walk us through that. Yeah, if we manage every game scared of somebody getting hurt you're never going to make chances you're never going to take chances like to me that's just, uh we got a we got a bases loaded situation with manny machado up in the 2-0 count in the 10th inning because we made that decision because if kenzel doesn't run tatis's ball doesn't roll through the hole you don't load the bases you don't have your best chance to score so you're going to manage the game aggressively every time at least i am i'm not going to manage passively out of fear of like somebody on the field might get hurt at some point in time that's some point in time it happens in baseball that's ultimately not why we lost the game today uh it wasn't like there was a defensive miscue that was made or a pitcher that had to hit in a certain situation i think we're just going to manage aggressively always uh, taking chances to win games um, you, you said it's good spirits you don't have any idea the loss of Tatis. I mean, do you expect it would be a day or two? I have no idea. Uh, hamstrings are funny things. You, you never know. He might feel great tomorrow. It, you know, it might take a long time. Uh, I've seen enough of them in time that you just don't have an answer right after they happen. With how well he's played, how much he means to the franchise uh, once it's kind of running through your mind, he's going to go down like that. Everybody's just hoping it's not severe. Hoping he's ready to go sooner rather than later. What, what did you think of the jobs of your uh, infield reinforcements today that evening? Yeah, they did good. I mean, obviously, we're trying to put Will out of the way of the baseball in the infield as best we can. And uh, it's a really nice play by Manny up the middle. Uh, gave us some energy and momentum. And uh, we just weren't able, able after the first three innings of the game to do much offensively. We created that one.